Today, we're trying to do some, some catch and cook. I'm gonna go back to classic fishing. I'm gonna do the fish finder rig using sand crabs. <laughs> we're gonna see if uh, we can catch some uh, perch or anything that will bite. The condition is, uh, it's really good. It's overcast, the water is incoming. That's a good sign that we're gonna catch fish today. And my setup for today is, I'm using this light tackle. This is a Phoenix Trifecta. One four to three quarter ounce lure weight. This is a nine footer. And I paired up with this. Look at this. This is brand new from Pisifun. They sent me a, a reel to test it out. This is the Carbon X 4000 from Pisifun. Man, this reel, look at that. It's really smooth. And also look at this camera right here, folks. Uh, this is the uh, eye contact. Thanks to um, Cody for sending me this. I was really surprised about the quality of the picture of the uh, video. Oh my goodness, it's really crisp, very colorful. I'll show you, I'll play it. This is the GoPro and this is the Icon Text. Look at the comparison. This is kind of like a, a flat color and this one is very colorful. Again, if you guys want to know the, what camera is this, I'm going to put the link on the description below and check it out. Time to go fishing. Stop plugging, stop promoting stuff, because this is about fishing. <laughs> All, right. All right, let's go fishing. We're gonna catch a big one and cook him, eat him. Let's go. So main line, slider, a swivel to block the slider from going all the way to your hook. And now from the swivel, your fluorocarbon leader or mono leader, this is 17 pound test line, probably at three feet and to your size two odd hook. So there you go, folks. That's it. That's your fish finder rig. I'm gonna use this sand crust that Kirby gave me just for now, because I'm gonna go catch some soft shell. This is not a soft shell sand crabs, but I'm gonna you use it for go now. Uh, huh? You want some more? No, that's okay. One is good. Alrighty, let's go. Let's let's catch them. Again, this is a fish finder rig. So our goal is to keep the the sinker or the bait on one spot. That's why I'm using a size three sinker. It's kind of heavy for my rod, but we'll see. Fish are not that far, especially perch. Just there, and we'll wait till we get a bite. But in the meantime, I'm gonna go grab some, uh, try to get some soft shell sand crabs right there. I can see some dark spot on the sand. Sometimes when you see that, there's some sand crabs in there. So just wait for the wave to come up. Oh, look at that. And from there, when it coming, when it comes down, just shake your foot on the sand Try to get that sand crab out of the sand and scoop them just like that look at that see that's a soft shell right there that is a good soft shell that's one there there's another one two soft shells I'm telling you man this is a striper candy and perch candy all right this is a good soft shell sand crab right here look how soft that is Woo. The difference between soft shell and the hard shell is the other one is uh, soft <laughs> and the, the other one is not soft or hard. All right. Yep. Don't need to cast it far. And just wait. Hopefully we get a good bite here. Oh, fish on! Fish on! Fish on! Yep! It's a big perch right here. Oh, it is a big perch. It's a big perch right here. Oh, yeah. Come on. Don't lose him, June. Don't lose him. Woo! Haha! <laughs> oh, it's a red tail! It's a red tail! Oh, we got a limit size for this one. This is 
which would be a 10 and a half inches for a red tail. I don't know how, how big this one is. Red tail? Yeah, but we'll see, we'll measure it. More than fishing tape measure, right there. Go on my website, check that out folks. If you want one, can get one. Zero. It's 10 and three quarters. It's a good size. Do you have soft shell? A lot. Woo-wee! Dang, that's a lot. You get... Oh, this one is perfect. You get two, three. Woo-hoo! Look at that! I'm gonna put two soft shell sand crabs. There you go. Just like that, folks. And we're catching. We're gonna catch the fish again. So I caught that red tail right before that waves break. I'm gonna cast it over there too, again. Yep, no more baits. So time and time, you gotta have to check your baits because that will save you time. You don't want your, your line out there without bait. So that's why you don't soak your bait out there. Because those waves just sometimes they push off the uh, bait out of your hook. Oh, I'm getting nibbles. Right there. See if you see that nibbles like bang bang. Those are small perch. So after that sometimes they they snatch the bait. So most likely I don't have a bait there anymore. So make sure you, you check your bait when you feel that little nibbles, bang, bang, bang. Those are small perch. Oh, I got a fish on here? I got a fish on here? Oh yeah, I got a fish on here. Dude, that was quick. <laughs> nice. Woo. What? <laughs> Woo! Kirby! That was quick! What? Look at that. I didn't know that he, I was on. Again, this is a barb perch. We don't have, need a size limit for this one. Oh, fish on. Fish on. Fish on. Oh yeah, fish on. Oh yeah. Woo! There you go. Let's go. Oh, this is a good one. It's a good perch right here. Oh, this is a big one. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Ah. Uh, Woohoo! It's fat. It's big. Yeah. Look at that. That's a big perch right there. Woo! I'm gonna put up a let's see this. Let's see this. Put three. Sand crabs right here now. Three big ones. I'm gonna cast it over here. There. Oh, that's a good bite. Oh, fish on. Oh, this is a big one. Oh, okay. Oh, this is a good one. Oh shoot, let's go, woo, fish on, come on, drag set, oh yeah, oh, okay, that's a good one right here, come on, oh, that's a good fish right here, that's a good fish right here, oh yeah, woo, it's a big one, woo, oh, it's striped bass, <laughs> Kirby, Kirby! Wow. It's a striped bass right here, folks. Look. Yeah! Call the striped bass right here. Look. <laughs> Woo! Yep. yep. 19. 19. There you go. It's a nice. good one. Wow. It's a good fishing day today. And after this, I'm going to do a catch and cook. I'm going to do the perch one because I like perch. Perch is really good. Ooh, that's a bit, that's a lot of fish right there, folks. Look at that. What? All right, guys. Now, 
it's time for us to cook this fish. <laughs> Let me go clean up this fish first. And from there, we're gonna cook him. Look at that. That's a good piece right there. Let's see what this guy is eating. Oh, nothing. Empty stomach. Oh, I did a bad job here. I'm gonna use the pan to save water. Okay, next, salt and pepper and butter. Look at that. I got a mixed up salt and pepper here. All right, look at this. I got this from Amazon. Call this the E-Tech City. Very small, very handy. Can just put it on your pocket. And it comes with the igniter. This red tail. Woo. I don't want to flip it if it's not cooked at the bottom because it's gonna break apart. I'm trying to be careful here. I think I need to add more butter. Deep fry with butter. What? Oh, that smells so good. Look at that. Oh my god, that's a that's a fail cooking right here. <laughs> Alright, it's done. Look at that. It's not perfect, but that's a food. <laughs> Keep some a bit of lemon there. That's it. And let's try it. Perch is better than shrimp bass. You can taste the lemon, butter. Oh my god, the butter! That's why fishermen's life is like putting butter. Oh man, so good. I'm gonna do this more. I'm gonna do more of catch and cook. Maybe if I got time. Done. Thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, please hit that like button, comment below and let me know what you think. Be safe out there, keep fishing, and be kind to one another. It's not just fishing. It's more than fishing. <laughs>